Hey guys, this is Coach Bob. Welcome back. And today, this video is about my reaction to today's video and some tips on how we can select workouts and work on accessories to get stronger. Today, guys, we are doing a little bit of weightlifting. The movement today is the push press, and our goal is to build up to a heavy set of three repetitions. So we're starting out with uh, some of our lighter weights, and we're going to gradually uh, build up uh, our weights as we go. Uh, we have got a good group out there today. Um, so I'm, I'm there in the back unloading the bar uh, right across from me in the uh, dark shirt. Oh, it's Christina or CK. She just walked off. And then we've got Rob over here. Uh, folks are just getting a little bit of the equipment that they're going to need for the lifting. And Coach Molly uh, is giving us uh, 12 minutes to build up to that heavy set of three. And uh, just to my right is Tierra. Uh, so a good group out there today and definitely a lot of fun lifting, you know, no stress, right? So we're basically just building up to uh, our uh, push press. Now push press is predominantly going to be a lower body exercise. A lot of times we think of it as like an upper body exercise because we're lifting the weight overhead. Um, the arms are definitely important, but Primarily, we need a good, strong, explosive um, dip and drive with our legs and our core core muscles to propel that bar up off of our shoulder. And then the arms pretty much finish. So I've unloaded the bar. I'm going to put a little tension into the bar with my arms, a little dip and aggressive drive, and then Try to lock that bar out back over your ears, squeeze the triceps nice and hard. I notice on this one that I'm slightly bending my knee, rebending my knees on that. And I didn't realize I was doing that until I'm watching the video. So I'm going to have to really kind of activate those quads a little bit more to really uh, punch that bar up there and to keep those legs nice and straight. Um, Rob, right across from me in the gray shirt, he's doing a great job with that. Um, and we'll get, uh, We'll get uh, to look at uh, CK as well on that. She's also doing really well with that movement. So here's here's Rob. You can see he he dips, and then it's uh, as he extends those legs, he just pops that bar straight up, and then he locks it out with his arms. And here's CK over on the left, and she's got the first one up. She's got two more, and uh, she connects those together. So there's not a whole lot of time that she's resting with the bar on her shoulder. She's just going to go right to work and lift it up overhead. I think this is probably going to be my final set. We've been at it for about 11 minutes or so. And I got two. You can see I'm really pressing it out with my arms. So I need more leg, more core, and it doesn't go, doesn't go up. <laughs> so that was the end of that. Uh, this is our 10 minute AMRAP today or condition, conditioning workout. I'm um, picking this up uh, here in round four. Four, we have an ascending ladder. So we're adding one repetition each round. So we start with one push press, then one burpee box jump, then two push press, and then two uh, burpee box jumps, and so on. And we keep building it up. So I'm picking this up on uh, round four. Um, I'm trying to pace the workout. That's maybe why I'm not going super fast here. Um, I'm just trying to survive. I just want to get through these burpees. And uh, you'll notice when I uh, come back off of the um, burpee, or yeah, burpee box jump number four, and I take my time stepping down. I'm going to try to catch my breath a little bit and make sure I, I'm not, uh, you know, I want to be in control of my breathing. And I know this is um, a lot of time where I'm at right now, I'm really working on that aerobic fitness. 
and uh, trying to build up my aerobic capacity once again. So it's, it'd be easy for me to get winded in a workout and then that would really slow me down. So I'm trying to have a steady pace throughout. This is the last and final round. There's uh, less than a minute on the clock. This is the round of nine. Um, the bar just feels really heavy right now. I think I got four reps. I got five more to go. I get one up. I'm like, gosh, I don't even know if I could do two more reps, but I trick myself. I say there's two reps. I'm like, okay, no, wait, there's two more reps. I figure, go ahead and finish it. So we got those nine. This is, I'm happy. I'm just going to do as many burpees as I can now in the 25 seconds that are left on the clock. <laughs> And I'm trying to do them fast, but at this point, this is about as fast as you're going to get for me. <laughs> you see other people in the class are not moving <clears throat> super fast either. And I think uh, this is the last 10 seconds. I'm like, okay, one more burpee. That's it. So I get to the top of the box, put my hands on my knees <laughs> and uh, Coach Molly's going around giving everyone fist bumps. So after the workout, uh, you know, it's a great time to work on some accessories. Um, when we do a conditioning workout, you do build up um, a little bit of that lactic acid in uh, the muscles, the working muscles, and that um, ends up in your bloodstream. When you work on some higher rep sets after a workout like this, what you can do is you can help to uh, help to train your body to clear that blood uh, lactate out of uh, those working muscles. So we had a series of uh, tricep extensions with a band, face pulls, and then bent over dumbbell rows. So finishing that up, um, just very happy to be able to get in the gym, get the work done, and then kind of uh, get, get ready for the day. So guys, thank you so much for checking out what's going on. Uh, hopefully, uh, we're giving you guys some good value. We've got a lot more information that we are bringing your way with each one of these daily workouts. So stay tuned, like, subscribe, and share with your friends. Thank you guys so much. That's literally all I'm asking right now is just like this uh, video in YouTube. And uh, take care. Peace.